Okay, so now we can have a look um, at this first task. So it's about decibel calculation as already said. And there is once again this formula um, for the definition. So it's always defined for powers. And for a level, we want to express a power in decibel. And we want to use this logarithmic scale. Um, but if we insert the power, the power has a unit. So what's the problem then? If we put something with a unit inside the logarithm, it does not work. Mm -hmm. You can only calculate logarithm out of numbers, but not out of units. And so that's why we, we need to have a second power, which is called here reference power, P0 or P0. And so power divided by power Units will cancel, result will be unitless, and we can calculate this logarithm. It's the decadic logarithm to the base of 10. Then we would get bell, the unit bell, and bell is not very handy, so we multiply by 10 and then we get decibel. Um, that's the idea of the decibel calculation. And so now the first task A is to convert a power of 100 watt into this power level. Um, in dB milliwatt, dBm. So what does the um, um, dB milliwatt tells us? Or how do we do this? Ideas. Th that's the result? <laughs> Now, how, how do we do the calculation? I'm, I'm not asking for the final result now, but how, how would you calculate this? And what, what does dB milliwatt mean? We can convert the power into milliwatt first. We could, for example, at first take our power, which is 100 watt, and convert it into milliwatt. And how many milliwatts is this? So, um, yeah, milli means 10 to the power of minus 3. So we, um, we need to have 100,000 milliwatt. Yeah, because if we would insert that milli is 10 to the power of minus 3, this would cancel with the three zeros here. And once again, we would have 100. It's like if you have 100 meter, if you convert 100 meter into millimeters, would be 100,000 millimeters. Okay. So what do, what do we do then? What is the next step to calculate the power level in this case? Put it, in Put it inside this formula. Um, so let's say the power level, I will just use this short form here. Uh, the power level is 10 times the decadic logarithm. I will just write LG of this power um, divided by P0. So, yeah, okay, let's, let's maybe directly insert the values. So our power, as we've just calculated, is uh, 100,000 milliwatts. And what is P0 or what is P0? One milliwatt, and this is this is what is meant here by this. Yeah, so the dB milliwatt here means this milliwatt here means that our P zero is one milliwatt. So we insert one milliwatt, and a nice thing that happens is these milliwatts will cancel each other. And this is wh what needs to happen because we only need a number here. Uh, we cannot have a unit there because then we cannot calculate the logarithm. Okay, so yeah, we have 100,000 divided by one, which is 100,000, so I, can, I could also cancel this one over there. Um, okay, so how, how do we continue then? So we, we could rewrite this as 10 to the power of five, because we have one, two, three, four, five zeros. So 10 to the power of five. Yeah, and then so the um, 
Ähm, ja, the, the, logar the decadic logarithm of 10 to the power of 5 is 5. We could also say, okay, we move this exponent of 5 to the front, in, in front of this logarithm, and the decadic logarithm of 10 is just 1. Okay, but it will be 5. So 10 times 5, and 10 times 5 is 50. So this means that our power of 100 watt converted into a power level is 50 dB m or db milliwatt okay just more or less inserting this into this equation um, dealing with the units and calculating the result what questions do you have so far okay seems like seems like no questions so what we could also do um, of course, is we can if if the calculation would be a bit more complicated, um, we could use octave to do it. Um, or of course, you can also use a calculator. But let's do the very same calculation in octave. And so our power is hundred. And well, I can I can write like this. I will just leave it in watt. And P0 is one milliwatt. How do I write one milliwatt here easily? I could I could write 1.001 of course. And then mm, Octave will say okay, you could also more easily write this as um like this 1 e minus 3 which means 10 to the power of minus 3 w will be the very same result okay so then I put this um, I, I want to get this level so the level of power and this is 10 times log of p divided by p0 or p0 and I calculate the result and oops I get something different so what's the problem here? This is not this is not log ten. This is um, so if we check what this means, help log. It's it says it's the natural logarithm, and natural logarithm means it's uh, it will be the result would be this nepper. Um, and natural logarithm means what is the base? Yeah. No, no. Then we post them would be decadic logarithm. The base is e, um, two point seven three something. So, um, yeah, the, the the base of this natural natural logarithm would be this here, um, two point seven one eight three something like this. Okay. So if we use the formula as before, but use log ten. Uh, then we get the right result because log 10 is um, yeah base 10 logarithm um, in German we would say or um, I, I also know the term decadic logarithm because the decade is like 10 years and deca is um, I don't know the Latin Greek word for uh, for 10 what is what is 10 in Italian the translation I, yeah, deci. Okay, so it's deci. So it's also something that has with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we call it uh, some log base ten. Okay, logarithm okay. okay. 